<laughs> good morning guys good morning guys top of the morning to you guys and um, uh, you can hear that I am laughing uh, it's 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 a very good time to be alive it's a very good time to be alive because um, sometimes some scammers are creative other times they are just plain stupid um, forgive my manners my name is Victor Isibo uh, here on this YouTube channel, I help you with due diligence with make money online and offline opportunities. Uh, if stuff like this is what you like, I invite you to subscribe to the YouTube channel. Turn on the bell notification icon, put it on all so that you don't miss any of my subsequent videos. And to my returning subscribers and viewers, for without you there'll be no me. Salute! It's a pleasure having you back on this YouTube channel. Um, disclaimer, I'm not an investment advisor. I just have a knack for doing reviews like this. Don't take my word for it. Do your own due diligence. I shall not be responsible for any profits you make or any losses you incur as a result of you interacting with my content. Now that we've gotten that disclaimer out of the way, <clears throat> we are on the website of jumiabai.com. And I find it ridiculous. And I want to make a call to all established brands that they can help us to combat imitation scam i mean if somebody is imitating you hmm, you are an established brand they, they create a scam in your name and they are using your name to scam people i think that you should call them out and you should shut them down get the authorities involved get the uh, people involved and combat this crime it's not only the job of content creators to do this I mean, it's your job because somebody is going to get scammed on that website and they will call you out, you the original people. These guys are, are doing a style that is similar to Gmarket777, similar to Joomcat, similar to all those Ponzi schemes, Mandarin Plaza, that we have reviewed before. Where they tell you that you recharge, when you recharge, then you place orders for items that will never be sent to you and they will allegedly be sold for you and the profit will be sent to you. Profit, you will not profit from goods that you did not see. How can you be buying imaginary, imaginary products and those imaginary products are sold for you and the profit is sent to you? Ponzi schemes never have products. That's the problem that Ponzi schemes have. They have buyers which is the downline, they have sellers, who is the upline, where is the product? We don't know. It doesn't exist. So this format, they tell you that you are placing orders for certain products. After you have gotten the product online, it is sold for you online and the profits are cruised into your dashboard. It is simple. This is what they say they do. But you know, what pains me is that they are now saying that their name is Jumia Bai. That's what, that's what pains me. Look at the website. Jumia Buy. And they are very bold enough, you know, to, to lay claims that they are the original people. I mean, it's, it's, it's appalling. Using the logo, using everything. Let us read their About Us section. Let us read their About Us section. You see? They said, Jumia, online shopping in Nigeria, number one shopping destination. Can you imagine? They are, not, they are not even remorseful. They don't have any conscience. They are claiming to be Jumia like this. They are claiming to be Jumia like this. They are, not, they are not pretending. They are not trying to hide it. They are saying that they are Jumia. If Jumia had an investment platform or money-making opportunity, apart from what they are doing and we know them for already everybody would know it would go viral and they will not create a special website for that their website is robust enough to have a column or a section that takes care of that this is ridiculous they say jumia is your number one online shopping site in nigeria look look at what these people are writing eh? This is, uh, this, is, this is ridiculous, guys. And I don't know. Let us click, click on grab. Let us see what, what they, 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 they have on offer. I mean, it's, 
it's getting worse. Somebody will lose their money here now, then you start seeing it on blogs, on social media, that Jumia has scammed me. And Jumia is not making any official statements about this. I mean, you should, you should communicate more. Let people know. Dissociate yourself. Put out a disclaimer. There is a website too saying that they are Jumia by. Deal with them at your own risk. They have nothing to do with us. Which one? What, what has Jumia got to do with Autograb? What are you grabbing automatically? Anything Ponzi is always superficial. Autograb. No, it's not only Autograb. See, stop grab. What are you grabbing? Instead of you to grab a legitimate job and start doing. Instead of you to create a, 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 a Ponzi scam website imitating Jumia. Why don't you get real life products? People are doing mini importation. Import goods legitimately into Nigeria. Advertise them on the original Jumia. Must you create a fake Jumia? I mean, I don't just know why some people just love to uh, 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 extort people. See, the worst thing about this internet fraud and extortion is not even the um, human and moral aspect of it. That's not the worst. It's bad enough. But the worst thing is that it makes you to be perpetually lazy. It makes you to channel your intelligence into the wrong place. See, those that design this website now and are trying to scam people with this thing, can they not create their own? Their own Jumia, the next edition of Jumia. Call it whatever you want to call it. Start the website. Let people start selling products on your website. That will grow the economy and that will give competition to the existing brands. But no, you will rather copy existing brands and act like you are the one, then scam people. Say they are Jumia. Let us look at when they created this, 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 this funny looking website. I know it's going to be a recent thing, you can imagine. You can imagine. They created the website 17th of April, last month, as at the time of doing this video. That was when they created this website. Eh? Very soon now, you will see Konga, Kongabuy.com. They want to imitate Konga. Sometimes you will see eBayBuy.com. You see Alibaba.com. Chimol has already tried to imitate Alibaba, saying we are an Alibaba company. Chimol, we are, give, we are giving out money because we don't have anything to do with money. We are Father Christmas. The modus operandi of all this Jumkat, Mandarin, Plaza, uh, 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 G Market 7-7 was the one that started this rubbish. The scammers behind G Market 7-7 made a lot of money and imitators started imitating their scam format. Now, this one see that names like Jumkat, Names like Mandarin Plaza has been exposed. What do we do? Let us imitate an already existing e-commerce brand. Look at Mandarin Plaza. Mandarin Plaza actually exists in the Ukraine. Now, they created a fake website saying they are giving people tax, tax refund, tax, re, tax repay, tax... I'm done with this review, guys. There's no need for me to even tell you it's a scam. You already know who Jumia is. Uh, the original Jumia. Uh -huh. When you see them adding buy to the back of Jumia for you to invest, that buy, it is the shortened form of buy buy to your money. Jumia, buy buy to your money if you deposit. Give this video a like if you liked it. And of course, share it within your social media community. And of course, please subscribe. And you guys may count a punch in the comment section below. Till I see you in the next one, I remain Victor Isibo. It is bye for now. The bye for now is not Jumia Bayou. Normal bye-bye for now.